what's up y'all um girl yeah i'm just sitting here recording this back like videos back to back so i can have some videos to put out because your girl is trying i'm trying to do this youtube life and i love it so and now i have not beat my face oh well don't come for me do not come for me but if you're new and you're watching this video and you have not subscribed i am rachel this is rachel social life tv where you will get a book of videos of of all kinds i am 25 single and I live in a small country as town in North Carolina, so that's his for his motherfucking accent. The thick ass country accent. But anyway, hi, and um, if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Hello to my old heads, and let's get into this review video for Little Women in Atlanta, season two. Okay, yeah, I know I haven't done a review on this season, but I'm gonna go ahead and just do this shit because. This season is um crazy. Uh since you know last episode Juicy bought up these two twins, Charity and Hope, I believe, but look, I'm gonna be honest, I'm just keeping motherfucking around. They look like some gremlins, so I'm gonna call them the motherfucking gremlin twins. Yeah, they look like gremlins. And so they the gremlin twins came for money and you know bought up some shit from money's past about what food stamps saying she you know played the system or some shit okay she didn't report she got a new job because she's trying to take care of her child and feed her child what the fuck it's in her past let let the shit go i wouldn't have did this shit there you first meet me people and you bring up shit like that something personal in somebody's past i would not have done that that's why money went from zero to 100 real fucking quick I would have done the same thing. You don't bring up shit. You just meet me. I don't know you from a can of motherfucking worms and you bringing up shit from my motherfucking past. No. I'm popping the fuck off. And that's what money did. Yeah, granted, Merlin and her fiance got Marlon got mad and wants her to, you know, you know, calm down, just look calm down. Like don't pop off. Don't be so quick to pop off is what he wants. And so money i guess was feeling some type of way about it and so you know she tried to you know she invited marlon out for donuts and coffee and tried to sweet talk him. he was like i don't know we might have to you know postpone getting married and shit until you know you get your anger management get your anger under control which is understandable i get it if you i mean because i'm the same way i can pop off that quick too and I'm a work in progress, but I'm single, so at the end of my fucking day, I'm going to pop off regardless. But, I get it, where he's coming from, like, you can't keep going and going in on people like that. So, Juicy met up with the Gremlin Twins, and was like, y'all owe money an apology. Y'all should not have done that there. And they were like, okay, we'll apologize, because I guess they got invited to... Z's birthday party for the other, oh, I can't remember her name to save my life right now. Left, left cheek, right, yeah, left cheek. <laughs> and so, they were like, okay, we'll apologize then. Okay, so, and then Andrea basically went to labor and, um, let's see. Yeah, she went to labor and baby daddy wasn't there. So her sister was going to step in because she's going to have to have a C-section. So her sister was going to step in. Then he showed, Chris showed up magically at, like, right at the last moment of a second. But I, I didn't like where the fuck were you at in the first place when she was going into labor, how she get to the hospital in the first place. And then there, the twins' mama came into town. The parents came into town to meet the baby, Aubrey. She's so cute. Congrats. I'm the new baby. Um, congrats to Andre and Chris for their new baby. Um, I don't, I don't know, I don't think Chris is really going to change because they said, like, the way it seems to me, he wasn't there for the baby boy. So what's going to make, what's really going to change for the little baby girl? So maybe, I'm wrong, who knows, we'll see. But, um, the other, I'm bad with names, the other tiny twin talked to their mother about what was going on between them and, when sis when she was on bed rest and she tried to come over and you know check on her sister and Chris wouldn't 
let her in. Like, she, he tried to block the door and shit, which was wrong. You don't do that shit, dog. That's family. Blood is thicker than love of the water. She was there before you were there, so you can't do that. He was wrong for that. But, and so, the mom, and like, basically, the baby came. The mama and then went into the baby, what well, was going to be the baby nursery, and there wasn't shit in there. Like, yeah, I know she was on bed rest, but he could have done something. He could have went and got the crib and put the crib together. I mean, damn. Do you even, I don't even think he's got a job. So, for one, he needed to go get a motherfucking job. Two, he could have went and got a crib and shit and made that baby room, made it basically baby nursery. Okay, because she's on bed rest. This is what the fuck you're supposed to see. You the motherfucking daddy. And so, basically, the mom, mom and dad were mad about that. Mm. Andrea got to come home from the hospital and was like, we need a crib. We only have a bassinet. We need, like, a baby crib. He's like, for what? She's going to be in the bassinet. No, she needs a home motherfucking nurse. She can't sleep in a bassinet forever. What the fuck? Like, he's, like, thinking straight. And that pissed her off. Then, um, they got to Z's birthday party. And Xavier's birthday party. And, yeah, um... That shit didn't go to it. It was going good at first, and then the Gremlin Twins showed up, and I think that just killed the whole vibe. And I guess once the kids left to go play, shit went, up, shit went left real quick. Left. The Gremlin Twins started out like, Money was like, I'm going to just kill him with kindness. Okay, do that. But I guess Money was still doing something I played about it. So Money, you know, was like, we're in here, we're going to talk. Yeah, that conversation didn't go too good. Because Money was like, I don't know. Like, for y'all to come and when y'all first beat us and air my business out like that, it was wrong. And, okay, they apologized. But that one twin apologized. The other little ugly twin didn't apologize. Like, what the fuck? So, the other twin was like, well, I think you owe my sister an apology. First off, bitch, I didn't air shit out. Y'all air my shit out. So, they're going to pop the fuck off. Y'all don't know me. You shouldn't have popped. They were like, you shouldn't have popped off the way you did. What the fuck was she thinking? What y'all think she was supposed to do? Just sit there and let y'all air her shit out and question her about her past? Fuck no. So, yeah, it was left pretty quick because the Gremlins went and started throwing shit and got to a food fight. They left. Everybody was mad. Juicy, I'm like, the left cheat was mad because Juicy was, she was mad at Juicy and Money. And I honestly, she should just be mad at Juicy because Juicy is the one who brought them there. And first off, they didn't even have no motherfucking kids with them. Second, nobody knew who the fuck they were. And third, they just drama. Like, drama revolves around them, clearly. And so, she left. and was like, I'm going to go enjoy the rest of my son's birthday. I don't give a fuck what y'all bitches do, basically. So, she left. And Juicy and I made money. was like, damn, I should have did that. Like, no, you shouldn't. You shouldn't just, you know, left it at that and not say nothing to them. Hell, been, been woman enough just to apologize for throwing a drink. Because I would, I mean, I would apologize for that. And then I was like, if I said anything, if I killed you with my motherfucking mouth, I don't give a fuck. So, um, the next episode that's going to come up tomorrow. So, y'all get another review tomorrow on that. Oh, the preview shows that Chris lived and the baby's still in the hospital and nobody knows where the fuck he went. Um, the other left cheek met up with Juicy. I think, I guess, to talk to her about you shouldn't have walked them twins around. Like, I don't never want to see them again. I wouldn't want to see them again. One, they ugly. And two, drama rise around them, like, good the twins. But, um, yeah, y'all get more reviews on Little Women, LA, and, and Atlanta. Those videos, these videos will be up. Two days, so y'all will be getting three videos from me today. But, um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And comment below what y'all think of this season of Little Women Atlanta. And yeah, don't forget to hit that the red subscribe button so we can, you know, sip this motherfucking tea, ju tea juice, whatever I decide to drink on. But I didn't do nothing that didn't today because I don't know. But anyway, I'm rambling. But I will see. I love y'all. And I'll see y'all in my next video.